And we're back to horses, and I actually have people joining me today. No. Maybe. So we have Icon and Helper. They were jealous that they could not play with me. Apparently I really cheesed off Icon by not actually paying attention to the stats of the horse gear. I was just picking pretty things. So I think he's come to set me straight by joining. Oh, it was bothering me so much. I was like, no, that thing costs four times more and it's four times worse. No. Why are you buying it? No, you need pink ribbons and frills. Okay, like, so... You got a stat max. I don't actually remember what I was doing. Um... But it looks like I've got enough grades, so... I, I, <laughs> I has grades. I has the grade. <laughs> so let me see if I can remember how to play. Okay, what was the button to go? <laughs> X. In the green. In the green. Okay. Sorry. I have to use the analog stick for this game. Whatever you do, stay within the lines. Oh, oh yeah, I got a lot of interesting names for my horse, for my viewers. Thank you. You still haven't seen Dr. S Dr. Horrible Sing Along Block yet, have you? No. Uh, Helper has it on DVD, though. I really like it. However, it's a little bit sad. Oh, it's, it's great. One day I'll probably watch it. I keep thinking, I'm like, don't, don't run into the fence! Me too. Did I knock off a... Oh, no. no, I got 10 out of 10. <laughs> I just saw that Let's one down. Let's see if you're really as clever as you look. Come and meet me in an hour by the dolmen on the beach. Oh, she wants to meet us on the beach. Come, oh, my little grasshopper. So I guess we need to go... Whoa. Wow. Ah. Wow. Ah? Why is it like freaking out? I can't freaking click on anything. Out. Okay, here we go. Um, I guess I want to go on a walk. Oh yes, and thank you to one of my viewers. Uh, dang it. I write these names down on post-it notes, but they're on my office. Someone told me what I was doing wrong in the, the rest room. I, I can only talk to someone two or three times, and I was wasting them all on the first girl, so I didn't actually know that. Thank you. Um, when was the last time I took care of my horse? Last week. Okay. Um, I stink at dressage. I should probably practice that. Go to the rest room. Should we do horse care again? Sure, it can only help the health and morale. So I guess continue. Yes. Do not continue. Do not proceed. I'm pretty sure doing a walk is is the way to get to the beach. Okay, ladies, a reminder of the rules here. The first to reach the flagpole on the beach is the winner, and we want to see a good clean race. Yeah, that sounds like it. Get on with it. Ooh. Go. Go. Butt mash. I'm trying to remember how to play. So you're so good, you gave her a head start, right? Oh yeah. Take the inside corner. Reporting <laughs> is quicker. I can't tell if I'm actually catching up or not. You are, but if you see another path, take it. What? I think we ran into some rocks. Jeez. Oh, I'm sitting here like I pushing the jump button and the horse is like, I'm just gonna walk into it. I think I've lost. Yeah, probably so. You didn't really want to win anyway, right? No, you want a challenge. Don't run into the rocks. I'm having a hard time cutting in because there's always something in my way, strangely. You have failed! Okay, failed. Ladies, a reminder of oh, I have to do it again? Yes, let's get Okay. Win. Losing is not an option, what? apparently. Apparently! 
pushing the button too many times makes my horse instantly stomp. Well, that's pretty typical. Is the horse going to reverse? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you just, you just pull back on the, uh, the lever yeah. a little bit. If we were playing Mario Kart, There's I could just chuck right a there. shell at her. Oh, really? Oh, I bet that's what I needed to do to win. Yeah, that, that's kind of... Yeah. Okay, we're not going to get stuck on this rock again. I think you have a better chance this time, then. No, she's still getting ahead of me. I can't go any faster. Take the inside. Use your burners. There's a rock coming up on my side. Push her off. I'm pretty sure if I run into her again, I'm gonna stop instantaneously for no reason whatsoever. This is what happens when I don't go on these courses by myself very often. Let's do it again! That's okay. so close. Okay, you said there was a path on the right I needed to be taking? Yes. That's where you're probably supposed to get ahead. Okay, I need to keep an eye out for it. Or she just pushed me into that rock. Cheat. Well, you're going to cheat too, right? It's right, uh... It's like right here. Or yeah, right here. Slightly shorter path, but and it gives you a direct route, but it will help you so much. Inside here, inside here. This whole video is gonna be one gigantic fail. It's like the Barbie video over again. <laughs> Except the Barbie video was like, oh, well, it's it's Barbie. Okay, we lost again. Yes, you have failed! Yes. Okay, get a letter cut in front of me like the cheat she is. She's gonna swing wide right here at the start. Hit the fence that's invisible, right? Okay, and then take the shortcut right here. The other girls rolling around saying you cheat. She's probably gonna make sure you stay on the inside on the corner. Stop because she's a big cheat. Why don't you cut her off and don't let her get ahead of you? You'll win. Seems to work for her. I think I won finally. Could it be? You've won the first half of the race. Yeah. I had to cheese me off, but I had to do it again. I had to race back. Seriously, to give you a perfect score? Whether you get a perfect score or you don't get a score at all, so... Wow. You might have won the battle, but the war is far from over, believe me. Q, wait up! Gosh, she can be so touchy. Watch out for her. She's planning on being the head of the class, and she's capable of doing anything to get there. I don't intend letting her get away with anything. And you'll pull it off if you're mentally ready. Don't forget, the library is the place to do the preparation. Watch out for yourself, princess. That girl's a real loose cannon. What did you just call me? Horses is a murder mystery racing game, right? <laughs> That's a safety game. <laughs> No, I think it's more like a Pokemon game. <laughs> Gotta catch all the horses. Why is my controller being stupid? No. Oh my god, I'm not pushing anything. <laughs> Look at it. Probably just be reset. Off analog? Hold on. I must have been pushing down one of the analog sticks when uh, the PlayStation loaded. Playstations don't load. Let's do some dressage and have Icon yell at me some more about the controls. No, not that way! Okay, <gasps> I, I was like, no, don't let go, don't let go, you let go again! The bad thing is, though, if I was doing this myself, I would totally... Doing it over and over and over again until I got perfect on everything. Over time, I've learned you can't be perfect all the time. Just most of the time. 
This must as long as you done. do it eventually, it's okay. Like Smappy said, you said you have to progress with the storyline at some point. Now hold down. <gasps> Ooh. Ah. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Look at that, 10 for 10. No, I didn't get 10 for 10. On that I, last one you did. Oh, yeah, but this is the best I've done so far. Yes, it is. It's because we're watching you. Oh, yes, and Rhodey was here. Smappy does a lot better underneath pressure. <laughs> no, I don't. Smappy is known for handling pressure, like extreme situations. Okay. So... <laughs> is that another comment that would have, like... Viewers said was why can't he be in here? He just just because he doesn't want to be social doesn't mean he has to be in the 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 restroom. And I guess that's true. He could just really like this room and not want to talk. It's kind of funny. Everybody likes this room though. Oh, it's got a CD player. Let's talk to this person. Don't you have anything better to do than disturb people when they're studying to talk about clothes and makeup? Listen, we may be in the same team, but I've got stuff to do. Okay. So be a good girl and leave it out, all right? Not bad for an introduction. Things are looking up. <laughs> you know what was just funny there? The uh, what she said was different than what was the text. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, it was. Princess, I've got nothing to tell you. My my, there's manners for you. Did I just waste? I don't think I know you. Didn't anyone ever tell you not to talk to strangers? Okay, maybe some other time then. Yeah, right. You just keep hoping. <laughs> and everyone's so polite. Well, that was a waste of a chat. Maybe it'd be more popular. <sighs> and now Esteban will not talk to you. Can I just walk into it? It's it's harassment, I think. Purple, blue, green eyes. With his purple, blue, green eyes? Is that what you just said? Did you, it is. What? I am so confused. He was gazing at her with his purple, blue, green eyes. I see. I Smappy, know. were you staring back into his purple, blue, green eyes? Probably not, since my height showed me like looking at his neck. <laughs> okay, and this was bothering me. I was like, what do the different brushes do? I don't know. They might. Look different. I was gonna say something really stupid. They might brush differently! <laughs> I, I was thinking something similarly, but I'm not uh, quite sure. <laughs> go, it's tough to go. say. Get that. Scrubbing. Brushing. Scrubbing, brushing. Brushing. Scrubbing, brushing. Scrubbing, brushing. Scrubbing. Scrubbing bubbles. What'd you Scrubbing, say? Scrubbing, brushing bubbles. Oh yes, the super soaker hose. <laughs> the mighty morphing super soaker hose. Pump. It always bothered me. They were like, don't wash him if it's cold out or wet outside or whatever it was. And I'm like, how come I can never check the weather? It's true. I don't want to make my horse sick. Maybe you can only clean him at certain times of year. Maybe, I don't know. Yes, yeah, so you can't have a bath in December. <laughs> hey, maybe not. I'm sure Rody would love that. Just like, ugh, I'll just stand here taking it. Maybe I'll get a carrot. I mean, I've never owned a horse, but I don't think I'd want to stand 10 feet away from it and that... blast it with a high powered hose. Uh, okay, viewers, like, rewind like 10 seconds. Did that horse's tail look really, really long? And it doesn't it currently look really, really long? I don't know. I, I guess. I don't think horses' tails are normally that long. I don't actually know. Go measure your horse's tail. Yes. Quickly, quickly! The time is ticking! I like how I can actually do the arrow before it's finished. Although I'm not really watching it. Um, I'm trying to look at the arrow. See, I think that like the, the uh, was like jet grind radio worked on a similar thing with the arrows. What did? Jet grind radio. Uh. Except you were doing graffiti, not... Picking horses' shoes. <laughs> Barrier. 
But you know, same same thing in the end. Oops. Actually, that's that is the game that I bought my Dreamcast for was Jet Grind Radio, or Jet Set Radio, or whichever the Dreamcast <laughs> one, which I think it had both names depending if it was in America or Japan. So. Oh yes, and everyone's favorite thing, cleaning Fox? the stall. Ooh. I guess I could pause for this. There's no reason to waste video time for this. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. Oh, get it, get Although it. Although Helper hasn't actually seen this because he didn't watch some other videos. You didn't watch the videos, Helper? Uh, uh, uh. He's been playing uh, Skyrim. This, well, okay. I was about to say shame on you, but that's a good excuse, I guess. No, not really. Smappy is the awesomeness. Uh, it's no excuse for not watching her. Smappy's been telling me about how awesome Skyrim is. Skyrim is awesome. It's, yeah, Skyrim is one of those games that's like, I know I would love to play it if I actually played it. You know, I don't, I don't want to play it, that means I don't want to get hooked on it. You know, speaking of what not is... doing what you're supposed to, like 120 hours and not doing the storyline. Yeah, my sister's actually further in the storyline, and she's only had the game like two days. Wait, is Smappy doing that, or is, is Helper doing that? Doing what? 120 hours and not going through the storyline. Helper. Duh. Okay, I was about to say, I was like, wait a second, I was like... Well, then again, though, Smappy, you've been telling me about all the stupid things you've been doing, too. Yeah, I do a lot of stupid things. Fun things. I always hate that the, they hide that one little thing of poop under underneath where you're putting hay. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. Well, I haven't been all that serious on uh, Skyrim, either. Well, I was gonna say, I mean, I played Fallout 3, and half the fun of that game was doing all the side quests and missions and stuff, and it's, you know, the same developer, same concept, just sci-fi instead of fantasy. Uh-huh. I actually did do storyline, uh, one day, and then Hopper got jealous that I had all this cool stuff that I got from the storyline, so he caught up to where I was. And then hasn't done any more storyline since? Uh, pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> Sounds about right. There's a reason I stopped doing storyline. I think I'd like run somewhere far in the game and I was like, I didn't feel like running there, so I was like, I'll do another day. I don't get the point of this mini game in this game. I, I mean, I know what it would be the point in real life, and I guess they're just trying to make it it's like what it's like to have but, your own horse, but. But I mean, this is not like a horse raising simulation game. I mean, this is a. It's not like it's named horses or anything like that. Well, no, but that doesn't mean it's a simulation. Like, there's a difference between, like, racing simulations and racing arcade games. You know, like, Cruising World is not like a, let's tune your engine. Now let's, like, enhance the torque. And it's, it's, not, it's not, like, about that. It's just, like, hey, if I double tap the accelerator, my car goes vroom and, like, pops a, pops a wheelie. All right, I got a 91 out of 100. Ooh. Acceptable results all around. You are going in the right direction. Keep it up. Backwards? Keep it I mean, up backwards. But I mean, that's like what a, oh. you know, a race. Oh. I love it when they leave us in peace. We can switch on the box, sit back. Can I have your attention, please? Harry Temple's here. The instruction staff request your presence outside the director's office as soon as possible <laughs> to assess your progress this year before the exam tomorrow. You have five minutes, not a second more. And wait for so, them to ruin our day. Pre-test test. Is his name Harry Temple's? Harry Temple. Oh. Here it is. The hour of truth is upon us. Ahead of you, you have three tests. Dressage, show jumping, and cross country. I would ask you to dig deep and give your very best. Your admission into other competitions depends on your success today. That's I wish well. you all the very best of luck. Thank, Thank you, sir. sir. Do you think they're up to it? Of course, they're not here by chance. Make the most of it, kids. You don't know what tomorrow holds in store for you. Dum dum bum. Giant rainbow dragon is gonna crash in and destroy the whole area. And we will kill one of your horses. Oh. Choose what? Do you think place. a giant rainbow dragon wouldn't kill a horse? No. It oh. blow out rainbows. Yes. Apparently, I can't choose anything. So let's pick that. <laughs> oh, here we uh, go. Confirmation. Confirmation? Is that what you just said? That's what I said. I was watching something on YouTube, and it was a magician named Piff the Magic Dragon. <laughs> He's the world's only performing magic dragon. 
and he has a little tiny dragon named Piffles. <laughs> it's really just a chihuahua dressed up in a dragon costume. <laughs> Here we go, the moment of truth. It's a difficult course, and the competitors will have to keep a clear head and control their mounts right to the end of the course. Well, if you lose control of your mount at any point of the course, it's probably not a good thing. <laughs> Especially if you're riding a bull. How does a horse fail to trot? <laughs> you have to wonder. That Winnie. I'm like concentrating so hard to try to get perfects on everything. As far as the trot, you could lose control of the horse, which is basically what it is. You can't control see. the horse and keep it in a trot. Because the problem is horses don't always want to stay in the... Whatever. Okay, so you're in first place, it looks like. Oh, my penalty was smaller. I was just like, I didn't get only a four. I said okay. Alrighty, Don. Is the Asian girl going to kill you? I, I don't know. You don't distract her. Oh, this music doesn't make me feel any better. Nancy Drew has ever tried to solve her own death. And if we were playing Nancy Drew right now, we would like manage to get her in the hospital like three or four times by now. <laughs> That's true. It's like, what's oh. that? You went riding without a helmet? You're in the hospital. Penalty zero! <laughs> nice. That's what I'm talking Yay. about. <laughs> I just heard that one Nancy Drew game. We got on the bicycle and went riding on the bicycle without a helmet. Hospital! Yes. And we were in the hospital two seconds later. It was like, that must have happened like three or four times, too. Before we figured out what what was going on. Yeah, we just kept oh. doing it. I forgot how to do this. Oh, quickly, quickly! I'm stuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, there's no timer. Except for the timer. Okay. We didn't get counted a penalty for it. The first time we did it? No, we didn't. It'd be kind of nice if they give you like an actual like path, you know, like a little yellow dotted thing. Like in the last one? Yeah. As opposed to like expecting you my to figure out that you, know, you need to take these turns. Oh, sorry. What? Nothing, nothing. Say, so my problem was I thought I could just. For some reason, I was on that mode like when we were going on the beach, and I was like, I'm just gonna go around it. And I'm like, oh wait, no, I'm supposed to jump these things. This is like way too epic for this game. I know it is. Quick, kill the giant. Hey, there's Stonehenge. Oh, we found it. Was it lost? <laughs> I was gonna say, did somebody misplace it? I did. 
Um, oh, there it is. I was like, do we see the next one? Took it out for a walk and forgot where to put it. <laughs> Those hinges are really mobile. That's my pet hinge. And that would be for an awesome little pet. Like instead of a pet rock, have a pet hinge. <laughs> that would be so cool. You gotta. I mean, you gotta admit it would be. Uh huh. I'm totally gonna do that at work now. <laughs> Wonder what it would take. Let's see what my score was like after that. Yes, zero penalty. Wow. And my time was still faster. Eliminated. <laughs> Gosh. Apparently everyone Ouch. else went in circles. <laughs> went in circles and then jumped over it like control. hit their legs on. Well done, you carried that off great. We tried to give it our best. You really blew us away. I suggest we all go and celebrate this. You coming? Whiskey. <laughs> Look at all those fools gaping with admiration like she's this year's saint. She's not my favorite person, but I must say she pulled that off pretty well. The competition's gonna be tough. Maybe not. To win the means justify the end. Uh oh. That what is girl, the American girl, did you see her walking? She was like putting her foot. My dear pupils, your performances thus far have been excellent, and I congratulate you. Not all of us are at the same level. Yeah, but all of us are still in the competition. There's no denying that. Yes, Except but Except for the two that got eliminated. <laughs> Can't you two call a truce? There are many crucial aspects you have to take into account to be victorious. Like victory. Your relationship with your horse is of paramount importance. This is why I'm pleased to announce that tomorrow we shall be traveling to the United States. Over there, you will receive special training that will teach you so much more about your horse's behavior. What? <laughs> Nothing. It's just like everything in this game is just so overdone. Oh, look, America. Wow. I we love rock and roll. Yeah, we love rock and roll, and I bet there's hamburger joints everywhere. And the token American dances like an idiot in the open. <laughs> yes, we all do today. this in America all the time. Only when people are watching, though. Man, I gotta tell you, I was just outside earlier today doing something just like that. She makes me want to play a uh, bust move. I was gonna say, it looks like a bust move. <laughs> Wait, that's Japanese, though. There were a couple American characters in there. Yeah, like the hamburger guy. Oh. That eats hamburgers. That sings a song about hamburgers. I'm so pleased to be here. Yeah, we are going to learn <laughs> something still totally new. It's fascinating. <laughs> what made you take up horse riding? <laughs> well, it's quite the long story. And you? I think I learned how to ride a horse at the same time I learned how to walk. Still lazing around in the sun, are we? No. I'll have you know your new instructors here. We're dancing. Follow me. You've avoided my question, but next time you won't get away with it. Where's why do you say that? Because you always avoid talking about yourself, like you've got something to hide. No, my life just isn't that interesting, that's all. That's why I prefer to keep my mouth shut. So, uh -huh. where are they? <laughs> Who was watching my dance? Yeah, this video is going like really long. My dear that's pupils, what chopping's for. Today, you are going to discover a new way of approaching your horse. Learning to understand your horse and how to guide him <laughs> Bionic is so course. crucial for winning competitions. This is why we are going to introduce you to several new techniques of equine communication. Let me first present you to your new communications instructor, no Gwen link. Nicholas. Good morning, my gosh, and welcome to my Pink. lesson. Hey, this is one class I want to be good in. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? <laughs> <laughs> Her hair's stuck to her head. She can't really flip it back. Okay, I think we're way over, so we're gonna stop here for now. Bye, everybody. Bye, guys. Bye.